Uh, this is just going to be a quick video doing an overview of the £15 capture card that I bought off eBay. I'll be leaving a link in the description to it so if people are interested in buying it or wanting it, you know, I'd really recommend having a quick look at it. So for a quick disclaimer, I've already had a few tests of this capture card, sort of having a look at it. And in my opinion, for the price, you really can't get much better. You know, for 15 quid, you're getting something that is recording at H uh, HD quality at 60 FPS. So if you are interested in doing sort of console uh, gameplay or anything like that, and you know, you're on a tight budget, this is a highly recommended capture card. So this video is just going to be a quick overview of explaining sort of what softwares you use to uh, record the gameplay. And I'll then show a quick bit of raw footage afterwards. So this footage will just be sort of vanilla of what you get from the capture card. Now before we get into it, I would like to say that after sort of having a look and a little bit of a play around, in my opinion the uh, capture card quality does look kind of a bit washed out and a bit sort of compressed. Now for the purpose of this video I'm not going to do any editing on it or sort of trying to make it look better, however I would recommend if you were to use this capture card sort of have a couple of sort of hours or so to sort of figure out what sort of different colours you want and sort of how you want it to look. I think it probably could look very good, but I think just at the moment it needs a bit of tweaking and everything. And for the purpose of this video, you know, I want to show everyone what you're getting out of the box rather than sort of editing it and spending a lot of time and then sort of getting people's hopes up. So I'll quickly show you now. Basically, all you need is OBS. Now, for the purpose of this, I've just made a scene called Capture Card. And in the sources bit, you want to go on to Add and then Video Capture Device. So as you can see, mine just called USB video, and as you can see right there, it's already in. Just press OK, and then you want to stretch the video across, and then yeah, you'll see it there. Now, I had a weird issue, and I don't know if anyone else will, but it might just be me. But if you have this issue and you've bought this capture card, I feel like this will help because it took me a lot of sort of, you know, it took me a good sort of half an hour to figure this out. So as you can see, there is actually no sound being played at all anywhere. So what you have to do is you have to add another scene add an audio input capture, just name it, I don't know, uh, capture card sound and then for the device use the digital audio interface of the USB digital audio. Press OK and then as you can see there is actually sound but you can't hear the sound so if you want to hear the sound put the cog wheel, go to advanced audio properties and for the capture card sound just put monitor and output quickly turn that down but there you go as you can see that's fully working you can see it on the screen there the sounds working fine and to be honest as I said the capture card doesn't look too bad however I think you know with a bit of editing it can look a lot better but for 15 quid you really can't complain now just after this bit here I'm going to be showing you a quick bit of gameplay that I've got off Warzone nothing special it's just sort of demonstrating the quality of the capture card and like I've said already, it's going to be a completely raw image, uh, raw video, sorry, where I'm not going to do any editing, any tweaking whatsoever. Now, this footage, again, in my opinion, does look a little bit compressed, but, you know, with a bit of editing and a bit of sort of, you know, changing, like you can change the uh, quality with, I believe, properties and then configure video. Yet, yeah, so as you can see, you can change different uh, parts of the video to make it look different. So you can make it really saturated and you can do all that sort of stuff however for the purpose of this I'm going to completely leave it raw and then you know whatever people think they can sort of you know think what they think but for 15 quid you really can't complain so I will uh, show the video now of the Warzone gameplay on the capture card now if anyone does have any sort of questions about it because I have had a bit of a tinker you know just leave it in the comments if you want to have any sort of advice about it or anything. I have sort of done a few little tests and making the quality a little bit better. I will be showing those in a later video but for this video I just want to sort of show the raw quality just so people know what they're getting out of the box. So I will show the gameplay right now. Enemy dropping into the AO. Warm up start. Time to kick this off. Simple. Secure more cash than the enemy. 
UAV overhead. Bounty target is up. Let's get it done. Be advised, there's an enemy team hunting you.